psychologist uh, Dr. John Duffy and licensed psychotherapist Dr. Tiffany Davis Henry and we're helping viewers decide if their habits are genuinely weird or not. Uh, let's talk to Jeannie. Uh, Jeannie what's going on? I've been with my boyfriend seven years now. The first three years I was always stressed out because every time he leaves the house he's the most gorgeous man I've ever seen and women just flock to him. He has a very charming personality. He could have a lot of women if he wants to so it just I used to always call him and nag him, and that was not good for our relationship. And it wasn't good for me to sit home and wonder what he's doing. So we both come up with this idea that if I get a marker out and sign his private parts and then take a picture of it, he can go enjoy his guy time and I can enjoy my evening and not stress. And then he comes home and he shows it to me. I look at the camera and it has to match. And my question to you is, is it weird for me to sign my boyfriend's private parts to have a secure feeling? When you say you sign, what, what, what do you put on it? My name. Your name? My name. Are you serious? <laughs> I am. <laughs> Mm. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I uh, have been. <laughs> I've been doing. My, I've been a clinician for 20 years. <laughs> hey, Dove. Hey, Dove, hey, hang in there, man. It's I'm trying, Steve. I'm trying, man. <laughs> those, those, <laughs> Boy, I ain't see this one coming, man. Good Lord. Well, I, that's my point. I don't think I've ever heard of anything like this. So I guess you get points for originality. I know. I, I know. I, I, I'm going to read into that trust is a very, very important part of a relationship for you, right? Your signature technique, which, again, points for originality there, but it's based on mistrust, right? It suspects right. you haven't moved beyond. You don't trust him. That's, that's pretty abundantly yeah. clear. And I've got to think that over time, that is really, really unhealthy for your relationship. And I suspect he may not want to settle in for that for very long. Well, the signature's been going on for four years. We're, he doesn't really go out that, you know, that much, a couple times a week. I can imagine. And... <laughs> 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 you getting ready to leave the house? Come on in here. <laughs> Bring me that bick. <laughs> so here's what I think. The moment you whip out the Sharpie, the bick, whatever it is that you're using, the moment you do that and start to write your name, you already don't trust him. So my question is, why go through the writing of the name, the taking the picture, all of this? You're doing a lot of work. Why go through all of that for someone that you don't trust? Well, you're, you're in, you've been in this relationship seven years. This has been going on for four. He cheated when? The first three? Correct. Yeah. I, so, I highly suspected that he did. Yeah. So I don't know what kind of man would allow you to do that. Right, 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 right. Because a man that wasn't cheating, a man that wasn't cheating would say, no, you're not doing this. He's, he, there are creative ways around this. I mean, we can get a condom that's not lubricated, put it on, and it will never wipe Vaseline. off. Forgery. Vaseline, whatever. <laughs> There's lots of ways around this. <laughs> Him and this other chick that worked on that signature. <laughs> Anybody that's weird. That's damn crazy. We'll be right back.